what you want to do is start with the ball underneath you, relax your arms, have a slight bend in your knees, ankles and hips, and then you're going to move the ball back and forth, and as the ball comes to your foot you want to point your toe slightly up, you're just going to do this 60 times total. as slow as you need to. So this is level one of toe taps. All you're doing is touching the ball with the bottom of your foot and you're alternating against you go. Relaxed arms, relaxed body, practice switching feet. As you get it down more, you can go a little bit faster. You just want to keep the ball close enough where you can grab it so you don't have to move while you're doing it. It's going to be 30 each foot. So after you finish your right foot 30 times, your left foot 30 times. And as you get the movement down, you can start to hop a little bit with it. This is really working on your first touch. So that's level one. So this is level one of duct tapes. Just like duct tape, you want the ball to stick to your foot. So you're going to start with the inside of your foot, touching just the outside of the ball. The ball is going to be in front of you. And as you go across, the bottom of your foot is touching the ball, the outside. You're just moving back and forth, keeping your foot on the ball at all times. And it's 30 each foot as you get it down. Start to jog, jump a little bit with it. Do 31 foot, switch to the other foot. And that's level one of duct tapes. This next one is level one drags. And all you're doing is starting with the ball on the outside of your body. I'm just going to start with my right foot here. I'm dragging it across, similar to the duct tape we just did, across my body and moving laterally as I keep moving across and stepping with it. Go back the other direction, same idea, starting with the inside of my foot, walk across. You want to make sure you face laterally the whole time. So it'll be 30 one foot and then 30 the other, and you can go a bit faster to tell it more like this. And you're just trying to keep the body at the same pace as the ball can go. That's level one. This is level one of step overs. You're gonna do 30 each foot and you're gonna start off to the side of the ball and you're gonna move your left leg in front and around to the outside, stepping over with. And while you're doing that, your right foot will follow and then your right foot's gonna go over and around the other side. And you're gonna repeat this pattern until you get 60. And I really want you to focus on the athletic position here. It'll be similar movement to when you're treading water or if you watch an egg beater working while you're baking. And that is level one of the step overs. So this is level one of drags to three laces. All you're gonna do is drag the ball three times as you did in the previous drag, and then go to three touches with your laces. You'll do 30 with one foot, which will be 10 sets of the three drags and three laces. And then you'll switch to your left foot for three times as well. Three drags into three laces. Make sure you're maintaining an athletic position. This is level one of in and out. You're gonna practice using the inside and outside foot of only one foot at a time. Brittany's using her left foot here only, going in and out while moving forward. Just keeping an athletic position, knees bent, ankles bent, hips bent, and then she'll go back with the opposite foot. You can go nice and slow to start, just practice moving forward. You aren't taking big touches here, they're little touches, nice and close. You can take a touch every step or two. And that's level one of in and outs.